All right, welcome here tonight, Affleck County. We're at Tattnall County Battle Creek Warriors Field tonight. David and I, David Heron, who's already committed an injury tonight. He's already complaining his knees hurting, I got his a, face hurting. I got a pregame uh, knee injury. Um, your face hurts too. But I'm gonna hang in there. I got it. You, I got your side. I got your back too. I'll be using the dagger to put it in there too. <laughs> <laughs> I can promise you he'll do that. <laughs> Hey, first off, guys and girls at home, uh, thankful we're able to be over here at Battle Creek Warriors Field tonight. We want to uh, thank the athletic director and the uh, principal once again to allow us to bring the broadcast yes, to our communities you. and the folks here at home. Uh, we love doing what we do. We love our, our pirates. Uh, we're actually on the field tonight, as you can see behind us. Uh, we have the buses behind us, but we're on the track or the field, and uh, David and I will be taking over from here. You have to bear with David. He's real slow. We're going to have to use a uh, screen here tonight and, uh, you know, try to help him see the game a little bit better. But the action yeah. will be right here closer to him where you can see. Yeah. Well, you're sitting there listening. To, he's listening yeah. to the producer. That's why he's doing Alan Cartwright is the uh, AD and Principal Flowers. We really want to appreciate them anyways. But also, David, man, I can't go without saying this to the young ladies. Affleck County Lady Pirates are at the ship. And what I mean by that, they won today against a great team in oh, Banks boy. County. They won 2-1 to one all the way to the bottom of the seventh inning. What an awesome job for our Lady Pirates. We want to give a big shout-out to you girls. The only people that are stopping you is you from winning this thing. So y'all give it a, a big go. And uh, go Pirates for these young ladies. Yeah, sure. I'm a Pirate for life. I love our Lady Pirates. I, I love our Pirates in general. But, you know, you, we're cheering from home. Uh, I got to work. David don't know what that word means uh, tomorrow. So I can't get down to watch. Watch you girls, but I promise you I'll be watching you from Affleck County. I'm actually going to band competition tomorrow. Are our, you really? Our Pirate Brigade will be in a competition in Ware County, and I am going to watch them. Uh, awesome, and I appreciate that too, David, because, you know, representing our, our community in so many aspects. Like we say, our Lady Pirates are there uh, representing us uh, this weekend and have been all week. Man, what a great job. You know, now our, our awesome band you know, going over to Ware County to compete in a competition over there in Ware County, we're, we're, we want the best out of them, and we already know we get the best because we got one of the best bands in, Af you know, in, we, in uh, South Georgia. We I, won the, where were we at? We won the Sound, Black Shear? Sound, Sound of the Silver. Black, Black Shear, that's right. We uh, took everything, and actually we went and we were in a big one the other day in Valdosta. Yes, sir. We had like 16, 18 bands, and we finished – seventh or fifth or something like really high. high yeah it was high high classification bands yeah. that we were part of we're proud of our pirates all together guys there's so much great things going around uh Appling county right now and we're we're thankful we're able to bring these to our community and you know not just uh Appling county we know that we've got fans out there uh you know all the way and man there's no telling where they're at i mean tonight you know there's folks that has watched us in japan I had a guy come into the store. He said, I work all over the, you know, all over the country. He said, I got to watch you guys from Japan. We've had them in Great Britain. They still haven't forgot you, Chris. No, I just can't. Uh, yeah. Dubai, you know, we had a father that was doing some overseas work. That's right. Uh, and we're, we're thankful that we're able to bring these broadcasts to those folks, too, that can't be here. We understand that that issue, and we're very thankful that we're able to do this. And uh, we're very thankful to b and Broadcasting and the Backs of New News Banner. Jamie Gardner has done extraordinarily great job here bringing this to our community above and, above and beyond you know and we're thankful to be a part of this uh glad jamie brought us on you know yeah, i mean i don't know what he was thinking but still well actually it wasn't jamie jamie asked me and then he said you got anybody in mind and, and i you said you needed a number one announcer so I, you well, called me so that's you know, i needed a number one but it wasn't that <laughs> 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 Hey, I'm telling you, he has been on a roll this week. I have, y'all. Thank, thank, the, thank the good okay. Lord. That's okay. Cole ate your lunch a while ago. Actually, okay. I, I wanted to tell you guys, and Nicole's listening now. I, I wanted to do this when I got on air. I actually went and got me something to eat, and guess where I went? I don't know. I'm getting a look from Cole. He'll probably cut me off air. I went to the Rusty Pig. <laughs> Cole's over here shaking his head now. I love you, Cole. <laughs> See, that's why he wasn't here to help us set up. Okay, now we know. It was just a sandwich. That but was his. I had to do something, guys, because when I leave here, i got to go back to and work. And that sandwich was that big. 
<laughs> that's a small. <laughs> for you. <laughs> for me, it is. <clears throat> but, no, guys, really want to say this. Uh, thanks for what we do. Getting a few little uh, folks in here. Hey, one of my one of my favorite guys. Got to give him a huge shout-out, Samaji Gothi. You remember Samaji? I do. I do. Love that young man. He knows it. Uh, Samaji actually come over here with me and my father-in-law one night. Him and Greg Dixon come to a football game with us one night. We had a really? time of our life. They didn't. Know how, he didn't know how to take me that night, but he's understanding now. I ain't changed a bit. Uh, Charlotte Smith saying, "Let's go Pirates!" Number five, Darion Smith. Darion, uh, great athlete. The judge. Yes, sir. Miss Holly's watching us. Miss Holly Rents. Let's see who else, David. I'm going to scroll down a little bit. Mr. Terry Center says, hey, Christina in the band. And he says, hey, Doug. Um, yeah. Um, yeah. Um, I ran into somebody a while ago. Um, said, hey, tell you, hey, Christina. <laughs> I could only imagine. Got to give a big shout out to Stacy Wilkerson tonight. Uh, he told me to leave David alone. Stacy, that's not going to happen. I'm sorry, brother. I, I love him too much. Uh, if he left me alone, I'd have to watch my back he, even more. Yes, sir. You know, right now we're, we're, we're getting ready to take the field. We, we've probably got about 15 minutes before the game gets started here against I'm Staten sure we'll County. We'll go into the national anthem and stuff. Yeah, we will. We'll stop for that. Um, but. Ceremonies and stuff like that. But I'd like to say, you know, we mentioned a while ago about Staten County and all, and I'm telling you, we love coming over here to the Battle Creek Warriors, great facility over here. And yes, every sir. time we've been over here, whether it's basketball or anything, this, the hospitality here has been oh, overwhelming, real. I mean, super nice people. Even yeah. when we come here today early to set up and stuff, everybody that we met were just that's, super nice. I mean, they're just and, – and great atmosphere here. That's South Georgia at its finest, brother. It, that, it, you it know, really is. You're and right. It, and I was going to say a while ago the reason uh, last week we couldn't do, we went, wasn't able to get permission from – from the school that we played, but I think the Lord was looking after me because I got sick and wasn't able to do it anyways. Uh, you know, I know you went and I went. Kevin, you know, Williams took a picture of you and the yeah, wife, this, and, this and he could have kept, kept you out of standing it. Standing in front of y'all need to see this guy right here now. This is our photographer on the field photographer right here. He, uh, you know, he beat Chris in golf one um, time on the same on the same course that Tiger <laughs> won on. So. <laughs> I mean, how much did he pay you to do that? And, uh, he did. I mean, it's the truth. Yeah, he owes you. That's right. He owes you for that. <laughs> yeah, he did get lucky, but that was just one of those uh, laps of minds and laps of days. I, I you don't know, care. We loved it. <laughs> You'll never hear the end of it. I still not hear the end of it. But you know, I love it, man. I I, I enjoy what we do. Uh, Braden Griffith says, best announcers in the state. Man, I appreciate that. That's a humbling remark, and we really do appreciate that. I like that old dad of his. He's a pretty good old fella. Deborah Muller says, go Pirates. Hey, a big shout-out to one of my favorite young ladies, and she'll never understand it. Angie Stone Green is watching us tonight. And I told her today, because I actually got to talk to her for a second, she called me and asked me a question, and I said, you know, I'm going to give you a huge shout out tonight. And I, I want to make sure I do. Angie, you're, you're an awesome lady, and I, sure I appreciate, are. you know. You're such a trooper being married to Mark. I mean, I'm God bless her, so, yeah. Bless your heart. Yes. Bless your heart. God bless you. <laughs> <laughs> Great to no, have We it. love both of them. Definitely. Uh, let's see here. Levi and Ashley Wright said, Wild said, go 12 U All Stars. Yes, sir. You know, I'm sorry, the wild. wild. You That's got, a wild man. I'm sorry you got David as a coach out there. <laughs> Uh, got some folks watching from Savannah tonight. Uh, Jason Hester uh, watching from Jessup tonight. Hey, nephews Jason Griffiths. That's Lisa Tatum Massey. Uh, one of our favorites, uh, Darren Jackson, better known as Buck Wheat, to those folks that are, that are old. Yeah. That's, our, that's our buddy there. That's yes, a good guy right there, man. You don't meet no fun. Christy Lynn's crap says, hey. Uh -oh. Watching from Tennessee, Rick Milton. Hey, here's another one of my favorite guys that graduated with him, Tori and Benny Moore. Uh, Benny and Tori Moore watching live from Texas, the real deal, number 15. Look at that shot. Hey. Hey, we see you. <laughs> Can't believe you can get David in that screen. There you go. Wave it up there. Our cameraman, <laughs> Our me. Kevin Thompson up there. I have not. Yeah. We do have a new helper. Introduce us, David. Uh, we have Cole Gardner here with us tonight. <laughs> We're um, <laughs> Lawson Dixon is with us tonight. He is our um, scorekeeper. Uh, going to be running. So all that fine stuff you oh. see. Him. Bear with us, guys. We're praying. We're going to be right back. Hold on just a second. Please watch over all football players, cheerleaders, fan members, and spectators as we play the last home game of the season. We pray that you give everyone the strength to perform their best tonight and to play with sportsmanship and respect to our teammates and opponents. 
Thank you for all the love and encouragement you've given us this season. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you, Ava. At this time, we ask that you please stand as our Sound of Pride marching band enters the field to play our national anthem. All right, folks, we're back. That was a great job by the Tattnall County um, band. Um, I forgot what they called them. That wasn't a pirate brigade. That's the Tattnall County band. No, they called them something. I forgot what I apologize. And, folks, and being saying that, and I always tell you and all that stuff and all, you know, we're going to be doing this, and we'll be calling out some, some players' names. We like to give props to not only our team uh, but other teams that we play and all. Uh, we appreciate good athletes and all, and we don't bash them. But I will tell you, if we mispronounce a name or something, please don't be mad with us. We don't do it intentionally. You're right. <laughs> Oh my good Laura, that she's <laughs> wow. There's our pirate brigade. Uh, good shot of our pirate brigade. Big large band, and um, you'll get to hear them tonight. Loud over there, and and uh, looks like we got a good crowd's coming from Afton County, still piling in here. Uh, and we usually do that every time we travel with Appling County uh, fans. They, they like to come. Uh, you're right. They really are. And yeah. Yep. And I'm telling you, and the state needs some really good officials and all that. It's hard, you know, find it. Bill Clegg has made it in the house. <laughs> And uh, look at this shot across the. He says I can't read, and he's sitting there looking at his phone, and he can't figure out what he's talking. You know, he's um, he's all mixed up here, but I. Uh, 
You know, I, I had the pleasure of talking to his mom last night. And I had the pleasure of talking to him a while ago. Yeah. Uh, yes. Uh, it really is. There's a good possibility he may be he may be suited up. Uh, uh, that's that's on him as coaches and the doctors. <laughs> so David's been over here talking to himself with no sound. Y'all, I am sorry. Chris has been talking, but <laughs> David. <laughs> Oh, Larry Dwayne Carter says, hilarious. David, you are doing a great job. Keep it up. And guess what? You know what? David was doing a great job by himself <laughs> because Cole didn't turn my my uh, headset back right, on. Here's our captain walking right here in front of us. <laughs> no, they wasn't Looks complaining like that I wasn't talking. It's going to be big number 53. That is the big cat, Mikael Reed. Behind him is number five, none other than the judge, Darion Smith. Then we have... Number 19, who is that big boy? That's Grayson Hashtag Hall. That's it. And then following up. I don't know who that fella is. That's big number one. I don't know who he is. That's that's old. Uh, Marion Williams. What do we call him? Uh, I don't know. He ain't got no good nickname. Volkswagen. No. Volkswagen. Yeah. Maybe Beetle. That is the truck. <laughs> Choo-choo. And he has seriously earned that name because that truck will run over you. And, uh, and back sure will. up and run over you some more. <laughs> Maybe he got him a fill up for the uh, game tonight. Yeah. Uh, over at Appling Tire. I've seen Scott Hampton was uh, watching us a while ago. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Maybe we'll get a look. No, Chad. There. I'm sorry, Chad. Chad, don't, don't whoop me next time you see me. There's a good shot of our Pirate Brigade. Man, we've got one of the most awesome bands. And, again, uh, David reiterated about this earlier. They will be traveling over to Ware County tomorrow. Folks, if you're over that way, stop by the stadium. Make, and make plans to go over there. They, make you plans. Know, they're, tomorrow evening they'll be over there. I think they start somewhere around 2-ish maybe or right. something. Um, I can't remember. Um, I mean, go over. There's a lot to do over there. Go over there and support this Pirate Brigade. They would love to see you. You know, the more cheering for them, the better off they are. And here's some of our pirates coming in front of us here. I Some see of the professor, yes, Justin sir. Brock. He's been injured. Trent Griner has, has a deep bruise. Thank goodness that's all it was. It is, yeah. What, nothing, and, um, no break. And I got to say, you know, and you're talking about um, prayers working on my grandson, Ty, who was a pirate. He's sophomore year at Methodist University. Uh, thought he had a broke hand wrist and couldn't find all out. Right, their, cap not. Uh, their captain is Xavier Friendly. Uh, number 34 is Greg Edwards. Number 61 I do not have. And number two is Isaac Brown. And here's the bad thing about this, guys. A lot of times, David and I, when we can't get their um, roster, we have to go to Max Prep. And if it's not updated regularly, we, we have an issue with some of these kids and, and calling this, their names. This happens a lot. And if you're listening to us from Tattanoe County, please let us know who this kid yeah, is. Yeah, just tell us on our broadcast on Facebook. And, uh, hey, wait. Squirrel. But it's a big old squirrel. Squirrel. I, I got to give him a shout out. I see that, yeah. Trey Schumann. Trey Schumann. He's a big old squirrel. Yeah, he's a very big squirrel. <laughs> Trey, love you, buddy. Glad you're watching us tonight. Hope we do a good job. Patrick Seller says, let's go, Pirates. Uh, let's see who else real quick. Hey, Derek Tillman's just uh, joined us. Uh, right. That That is the husband of uh, our awesome uh, Lady Pirates coach, uh, Lindsey. Yes. Um. And he and his, here's the next thing. He's a coach too, so he's out there straightening Lindsay out now. I'm Derek, sure. That, I told her what you I'm, said. I'm, yeah. I, okay. I'm, Derek I, did tell me that. Remember, yeah. he said I'm I'm keeping Lindsay straight. Oh. Okay. He said I'm the boss. Just like you're the boss <laughs> at your house. I am. When I'm not there. Yeah. <laughs> Ask Mandy. Or Mandy's not there. <laughs> That's what I said. Yeah. All right, they're flipping the coin right now, folks. We're getting ready for some pirate football. They're getting ready to walk through or run through. Our great cheerleaders out there, they have got a run through for them. And, and, uh, Man, I tell you what, David, we haven't got this close see up. We to can see the toss here, see who won. We have, well, we've got some big old youngins on our team, don't we? We 
Looks like uh, Tapno like, has won. No, it looks like the Pirates have won. And they oh, deferred. and they deferred. And, uh, <laughs> Man, I'll tell you what. These are some good-looking youngins out here. I'll tell you what. Love our Pirates. Yes, sir, man. Proud of them. One of my favorites walking hey, back all. here in the very back, or two of them right there. Yep. Number 11, Nehemiah Howard. Hercules, Hercules. <laughs> Coming up, giving us a handshake. Proud of our Pirates. And number 51, I got to give him a big shout out. That's my boy, Jacquez Van, Boogie Man. Love well, like that young man. Nehemiah went over there, to our, we got some of our younger middle school kids over here, ball players right here, and he goes over there and fist bumping them. Earl Bauckham's watching us. You better be behaved tonight. Hey, you know what? Earl come over here bragging on how good of his stakes has been that he's been telling us about. Look, now, Earl, we no, now we got that. He owes know, us a stake. He owes us a stake. That's we right. We just did you that. Know, I've heard about these stakes before. I've heard, but I hadn't eat. Okay, here comes the Battle Creek Warriors taking the field now. Yes, sir. They're, they're, they're singing they're, night tonight. Up there with their band and stuff like that. They're doing good. All right, and lady. Uh, Good-looking uniforms, man. Look at them uniforms. Yes, sir. The cheerleaders are uh, getting off the field from the uh, run-through. We're getting ready for some pirate action here. Hey, I'm excited. I'm man, excited. I'm so excited to be back. Man, it feels like we've done it. This is a good night for football, man. We've almost got a full moon. It's pretty out here. It's not hot. It's well, just I'm, right. The temperature's good. I mean, and you sitting than, next other to than a, me sitting next to you, I mean, things no, are great. Sitting next to me. Makes me look even prettier. <laughs> You're going to need a lot more than me, aren't you? <laughs> no, really and truly, it don't take much. <laughs> Anybody says next to you looks good. <laughs> oh, whatever. All right, Where you folks? At, Laura, I need you. You're part of my tribe. Come get him. <laughs> it's on tonight for me and David. I apologize, but we we absolutely love All doing right, what we're we do. We're down here in the, in, the, in the end zone. In the, in the, in the end zone? In the, in the south end, I think that's we right. We're on the 53-yard line? And we're close to it. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, back deep for the Battle Creek Warriors, it looks like it's going to be number two. That's Isaac Brown. Looks like a junior. No, that's number six, ain't it? Yep, and number four. Trayvon Rogers. And there's kicks it deep. Now, another up man over there. I can't see his number. Got it. Big kid. He Number 23, uh, Kale Lawson is what they've got him listed. Got him on about the 30, I think. Excuse I thought, me, that was mark it. 22. How are they going to mark it on? Listen to this. Kathy Moore says, good luck, Coach Clark, watching from Steuben, Maine. Wow. Praying for you folks up there yeah, in Maine. We really are. That was. Don't know where how close you were to all that mess. But yeah, but yeah, uh, maybe they'll go ahead and solve that problem quick. Yes, sir. Um, yeah, praying for y'all. Laura says she loves you, you're, but you're a loser. <laughs> well, cool. <We're laughs> All right. Proud. Here we go. Tatnell's taking the, the ball. Up tight. Uh, quarterback out of the shotgun, takes a snap, hands it off to running back. He's running around that. Going right to the sideline side over there, and he Quinn is finally knocked down. A great Close. gain over there. About an eight yard gain. Grayson Hall with the tackle. They gained about eight yards on the first. Uh, First play from scrimmage. Looks like old Cameron George is playing a little defensive line there for us tonight. Yeah, Cameron's a good athlete. We're going to sit there and see if we can get some of these numbers in a little bit once this game gets to going real good and see if we can uh, name some folks for you. Yes, sir. All right, they're spreading them out a little bit, David. They sure are. Got it. They run out of a few different sets here. We do know that. They're going to see what they can do. One set back, back with the quarterback. Now we've got two to the right. Got a man in motion coming across. There's the snap. Hands it off to the runner back. He found a hole off the tackle. We hit him with a host of pirates on him, and they're pushing. Hey, it's enough for a first, first down. down. Gain of about, about six. six. Yeah. He lost his helmet there. Got a replay here. Yeah, here's the replay. He went in motion right there, and there's a quick snap. Hands it off to him. Good hole for him right there, and he just worked through and don't want to go down. Look, big push from that line. Tattnall County and Battle Creek Warriors. I got to remember I can't watch it live and on the I screen. I know. I keep wanting to look up and <laughs> see the, and, uh, the Warriors to the line. Them. Navy looking britches with, um, I guess that's a navy. In a gray, darkish gray. Good looking uniforms, dark helmets. 
wearing all white red helmets. Oh, they got five men in the backfield, but no call. Hands off. We hit him, thing for the loss. A flag comes out. Kid shouldn't have come off the line. Scrimmage. Yeah, the kid come off the line there, put him five in the backfield. Oh, did it? Yeah, I seen the flag come yeah, in. I don't think it's a motion. I think it's too many men in the backfield. I think you're going to be right on that. <laughs> and they caught a procedure on it. Oh, a procedure, really? Yeah. Penalty is declined. Penalty declined. They didn't. Well, they tackled them for a loss, so that's why they're, yeah. they're uh, declining it. Hey, one of our other favorites, uh, Madeline Taylor. Madeline. Our golfing pro. <laughs> she's definitely that. <laughs> well, she's playing college golf. She now, that's one that could teach all of us a lesson. You got that right. And Especially a good young you. lady. Yes, sir. Talked to her daddy earlier, bless his heart. Glad, Second glad and 12 here on your right. village pizza scoreboard. It's the first quarter. They're doing a lot of running here. 944 on the Another clock. little look here, Chris. And, and off running back. Put his head down. Mm, forward. He's probably just, three yards a game. That might be it. And folks, we we're not going to go jinx ourselves, but you know we are here in the middle of nowhere. Uh, we're going to make sure we keep live and you know no uh, no problems. But if you see a little bit of dragging or something, and you know the internet service can be a little spotty, but we're yeah. thinking we're thinking and praying that so far no no glitches. Yeah, All right, here's third and nine for the Battle Creek Warriors. Pirates are trying to hold. They snapped the handoff to the running back. He found a hole, and we hit him, squirts forward about five. Five yards there, David, and made the gain to about the 50. You know, something I noticed over here across the way from us, David, uh, you know, not that many kids on the sideline for Tatnow over there. Looks like they might be playing a little bit of Iron Man football tonight. Uh, it looks like it. Uh, I'm going to put them. you what now, baseball. Them were some rough jokers. Basketball. <laughs> Basketball. Track. Yeah, that's right. I mean, hey, wait, I got to give a big shout out to them. Last year's uh, soccer champion, double A. Uh, You're right. Man, they won a state championship. I got to give the Battle Creek Warriors an awesome shout out, shout out to, uh, for winning a state championship right. in soccer. All right, snaps good, kicks. Kind of cornered kind of a little bit. Wobbly a little bit, and we're going to let it roll, get away from it. And they're going to down it on yes, the 19. Uh, proud of those young men for getting that uh, honor and winning. They went down there against a lot of private schools and, and took over and won a, an awesome state championship and brought it back down here to the south where normally it's never been. Hey, so that just sets the, the standard and the bar high down here in a double A yep. territory in South Georgia for soccer next year. That's right. They set the standard real high over here in soccer. So, hey. Okay, the ball's placed on the 20. We're going to spread it out. We're going to. Um, Look at this defense. Twins line. to the left, twins to the right. Um, Got a 3-3 defense here. Yep. And uh, they giving us a look. Dason Griffiths, quarterback. Jamarion Williams, the truck in the backfield. Folks, we will have a few glitches. Just bear with us. We know the, the, the uh, signal is a little spotty. There's your snap. Griffiths to throw. He's got a over man over there. Nehemiah Howard. Nehemiah Howard. It's a 15-yard gain. Yep. Hercules, Hercules, Hercules! <laughs> yeah, that's him. That's enough for a first down. One play, a first down. Like it. Looks like um, Battle Creek Warriors. I think is that big number seventy playing nose right there. I'm looking, David. I do. I don't do not have a seventy. Uh, again, I apologize. I I did everything yeah. I could to get. Get a uh, yeah, a roster. Yeah, sorry, folks. We really want to get these kids' name and give them props. There's the snap. Looks another screen over there. Oh, a little to no gain. Uh, no, Kamoni Riles complete. I don't think he caught it. Oh, he didn't. No. Now Kamoni's one of those that has come out and uh, surprised us. He's had to fill in for for our number three, Cameron Hickox. But this young man is a he's baller. Really stepped up. You know, we no sit sir. There and say that we always tell next man up. Next That's right. Man up. And, and he's doing the job. Done the job. Oh, uh oh, we drew them off. No flag. Nonchalant. Back. He was far enough back. He didn't. He yeah, didn't break it. Got, I guess. I got on up there pretty well. Over the guy got back. Who's that in the backfield? That is um Williams. 
Another little pitch out over here to the left side. And uh, that hey, is guess who that is? Nehemiah Howard. Nehemiah Howard again. <laughs> Gave him about a little work tonight. This is it again right here. This is a replay. A snap. Little fake. Quick hitch lets the uh, defender come in. Hits his man. Gain of about six, maybe seven yards. Pirates are in a third and four. Jakari Kinsey in that slot. Oh, they did get it. Well. No, no call. Got back. They're playing enough off there, I think, that they have not hit that line. Got them three linebackers. There's a the snap. Griffiths looking to throw. Throw's got a man over there. That's Nehemiah And again, Howard. Nehemiah Howard. Hercules, That's Hercules, Hercules, Hercules. <laughs> for a first down. Been a lot of Hercules so far, hasn't it? So far, I like it. I do too. Give, hey, take what the uh, defense is giving you. Looks like Tattnall's going to uh, call a timeout here, folks. It is a 0-0 ball game, 638 on your Village Pizza scoreboard, folks. We're going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some Byard action. Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. Welcome back, Pirate fans. It is a first and ten for the Pirates. Pirates are up to the line. Around the 47-yard line. We got a man in motion. Little toss to him. Got a man grabbing hold of him. He's back still running, pants. though. But the Warriors, there's more Warriors come in to gang up on him. Threw him for a loss. Is that Kamari Riles? Thanks to the 21 Shaw Money. 21 Deshaun Robinson is what they call him. I'm, I'm going to try and get these names. Number 34, Greg Edwards. Defensive end is what they're saying for uh, Battle Creek. And I'm, who's that other one? Is that 21? I don't have a 21. You know, we hadn't run the truck a whole lot tonight. Nah. Looks like uh, Tattano County's got a. Having a little problem with their defense, trying to make sure they got everybody set. All right, we're getting into motion here. Second and 12, a loss of two here. Griffiths would snap. He's looking to throw again. Good protection. Oh, man broke through a big guy. He throws it. Throws it away wisely. Nowhere to go for Griffiths. A little slow start here for the Pirates, David. We're now third and 12. He had a... Tattano County Battle, Battle Creek Warrior that was tracking him hard. They're showing a little bit of uh, trying not to show much on their defense. They're trying to disguise a lot of stuff on us tonight. Yeah, they're changing a lot of stuff up on us. We got trips. Oh, he's off sides, but no call. Looks like it from our angle anyways. If we're in another passing situation here. Yeah, we are. Griffin steps back looking. Throws across the middle. Missed his man. He overflew that one a yeah, little he bit. Was looking for Nehemiah Howard. And that's going to bring up fourth down. And so we're going to have to punt the ball right yeah, that's here. That's un uncharacteristic of the uh, Pirates. Yep. Here's my favorite guy. Greg Dixon's watching with us tonight, Big David. Greg, yes, sir. Right. Big old Greg. I always like to say he's my friendly giant. Greg's a great young man. <laughs> Greg, really I don't is. mind talking good about you. I do it to your face. You know that, buddy. That's because he's big. Yes. <laughs> he would hurt you. <laughs> no, he wouldn't. He, he loves me a little bit. Griffiths snap. There's the punt. Nobody's back. Nobody back there. And it rolls and rolls. A, and get, it goes out about 
about the 17 yard line, maybe uh, 16. Yeah, somewhere in that area. 17 yard line, I called it. Look at you. I got to give a big shout out to our cameraman tonight. He's the only one that showed up and actually was ready to work, Kevin Thompson. Yeah. Uh, we got to talk bad about Josh Gardner. He didn't show up, but I can't blame him. I, I'm picking. Josh knows I do. Uh, Josh uh, is down in Columbus with the rest of the group, and uh, proud he was able to make that trip. Yeah. Yes, his his wife coaches with Alma, so uh, he's down there supporting his wife and the team, and, and can't blame him. You know, that's, and jokes aside, love to pick it. Old Josh, he's family to me, so. All right, it's uh, five minutes on the clock here in the first quarter. 0-0 ball game here on the Village Pizza scoreboard. Tattnall took over. The defense held the Pirates. Tattnall yeah. takes a snap. Hands oh, off. Oh, and he was hitting the backfield. We he's go. still he there. Still on him. And a host of Pirates. Who was that that got him? That was, uh, Man, that was number uh, 18. Marcus Robertson, wasn't it? That was number 18, was Cameron 18. George. Cameron George. They had him uh, stuff right here to begin with. Uh, number 15, the boogeyman, uh, was the one that pushed him to the outside. And Jacquez Van should be a loss on that play. It's going to make it second and 13 for the Tattnall County Battle Creek Warriors. They're right here in front of us now. We can see them a little bit. Yes, sir, but we can't call it from there. Remember that, David. you got to call it from the screen. Oh, I know. No, oh, you we don't. actually got it pretty good right now. <laughs> Cole's got the timing our, down. Our mastermind over here has back. Oh, man, he is. He, in. Y'all, this young man is unbelievably smart. He got it from his mama. Man in motion again. There's a snap. Quarterback keeps Faced it. the handoff. We got him trapped. Nehemiah Howard hits oh, him. Oh, who was that that come on top of him there? That was a hard tackle. Was that Burt? I yep. believe it was. it was. That hurt. There's a flag down. There's a flag down and a player down. That looks like in the vicinity of holding. But I, I'm telling you, man, that that's that's not a good feeling no. to have a young man of that size to, to tackle you. But that's... But, folks, we're going to be right back. Pray he's okay, and we'll be right back with some pirate action. Auto Owners insures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. Welcome back, Fire, Fire fans. They declined the penalty because it was a loss loss of yards. It's third and 14 for the Battle Creek Warriors. Young man did get up and uh, walk off on his own, thank goodness. All right. They uh, split three over here to the right side, David, and one to the left. Let's see what they – they keep showing us a lot of different looks. That's kind of scary, uh, especially – there's a snap. The quarterback's going to keep it. Oh, he gets we away, away, too. He got away from us. He's trying to get around the corner. Oh, and he high steps number 19. Yeah, he got over Grayson Hall but went out of bounds. Wow. But had a big game. It's going to make it fourth down, though. Great job by the Pirates to run him to the sideline and out of bounds. Man, look at that run. Right this there, young man. Somebody liked to have him in the back, and I can't remember who it That's was. That's Xavier Friendly, a senior. Yep. Great legs. We know they've got some speed on them, David. There ain't no doubt about it. They're track stars. So. Yes, sir. Brandon yeah. Williams looks like he's the kicker here for the Tattano County Battle Creek Warriors. We got Kellen Eccles back deep to receive the punt. All right, snaps good. good. Snap. He kicks Kick it off to the left side. Gets the Battle Creek Warrior bounce. It's going to make it past the 50. Pirates are going to take over around the 47-yard line. Or is that the 53? In your mind, it's the 53. <laughs> All right, we're going to stay right here with you because the offense is coming towards us. And they're uh, taking the field pretty quick, David. Yep, 255 dude. here. Olivia Britt said, thank you, Bax News Banner, for our food tonight from the Lady Pirates. Ship tomorrow. Let's go. Let's get it. Yes, that's right, Olivia. That's right. Take you keep home, that baby. smile and have a have a wonderful time. Y'all have fun. Y'all have done an awesome job. Just continue it. Y'all y'all playing as a team like I knew you could. Well, Dexter and Whitley's chimed in on us there. Very proud of those young ladies. 
Let's bring it home. We can get that cannon uh, warmed up for him when we get home. No going right. All right, Pirates is getting into here. There's a snap. And, and the first off. handoff. Williams, that's the first one we've seen. He's, He's still on his feet. They're grabbing at the ball. But not before he gains a good six or seven yards. We're going to call it a good hard uh, seven yards there. Yep. Should bring up second and about three. Second down. Got our big guys on that front line and just run it right at them. I guess pretty good size herself up there on that defensive line. All right, looks like we're going to be in the same setup there, David. Yep, Jamarion Williams still in the backfield. Hands off to Williams again, right straight up the middle. First down and more. What a great job by your truck. Jamarion Williams, first down, Pirates. Let's take a look at it right here, Chris. Look at that front line just open up a whole form, just blow people out right there. Everybody done their assignment. Enough for the first down there. All right, first and 10 from around the 37 yard line. They're coming at us, David. They sure are. Griffiths with the snap. Hands off to Williams again up the middle. Dragging he, people. Ah, he put them in the trunk. What you think? Another good. That may six, be seven, about another seven yards. Yep. Brought down by Greg Edwards and Xavier Friendly. Going to hear a lot of those two young men, Xavier Friendly and uh, I forgot the other guy's name. Greg Edwards. I'm sorry. Yep. Those two with the tackle on Jamarian. Uh, you know, hanging out with David, sometimes your brain goes dead. <laughs> <laughs> I already know what to say about that. That's <laughs> the truth. All right, it's uh, second and three, a minute and one on the first quarter clock. There's a snap. Another handoff. Hand He's got a hole. Left side. Still driving. He gets first to about down. the 25-yard line where they're going to mark him, but it's a first down for the Pirates. Down by Brown. A heavy dose of the truck could get us a touchdown here, David. That's what it's looking like. Kamani Riles out to the right in the slot there. It's going to be killing Eccles. On the wide side. I think we got the play in, got it ready, and I got mosquitoes tearing me up over here. All right, Griffiths with the snap. He's looking to throw. He's looking for somebody. He sees somebody. Oh, he's got him in the end zone. Oh, oh just, just off, off the, the fingertips, David. Man. Could have threw that much better in his hands, but Money he had his eyes on it. Back shoulder pass and just off but, his fingertips. But the good thing is he was out running them. Oh, he yeah. had a good clear shot there. Oh, yeah. I know he's uh, kicking himself on that one. Hey, but he, he's got a lot of chances to, to be able to do that. you got to look past that one and let's go. Yep. Going to make it second and ten for the Pirates from around the 25-yard line. They were going for the gusto there. Let's see what we're going to go with here. Um, just missed a touchdown that time. Yes, sir. First score to ball game would have been with uh, 13 seconds left in this. Sure, we'll get another playoff here. Yeah, I believe so right here. Griffiths with the snap. Hands off of the middle. And Jamarin loses the ball. Can we get on it? No. no they Just give up like the ball. Pando got the ball. Williams fumbles the ball. And you don't see that often. No, sir. Jamarion Williams. He's upset with himself. He knows it. But they've been grabbing and pawing at it. And good job by Tattnall County. Yes, sir. I mean, <laughs> looks like his knee may have been down. But you, that's hard to see in that pile. Well, no, it was... He runs hard. He does. He's a hard runner. And uh, when you got a big man like that, you're going to scratch and paw and try to get the ball loose. Cause you good sure job by Tattnall, though. Yeah, they get the job. ball. They take over around the 14-yard line. Number 52, big kid, Leviticus Butler. Is that a football name or what? Yes, sir. Tall kid, number 52. All right, I'm sure the Pirate defense knows what they need to do here. Try to get the ball back. We missed a touchdown and then caught They're spreading the ball us out up. a little bit, David. The man comes into motion. Oh, and there and he moved. moved. 
flag comes in, I, it should right, be on them. The right tackle and the left tackle moved at the same time on that one. Yep, that's going to back them up with six seconds left in this first quarter on the Village Pizza scoreboard. I'm proud of you, you David. Like I am. I'm very proud of you. That's right. You finally done a promo. I had to do that. And Earl, you're right. He doesn't have a brain. Reed's wife threatened me. <laughs> I'm not worried about Reed. I'm worried about Reed's wife. All right. They're getting set here. Man goes back into motion. Quarterback takes a snap. He hands off right at the middle. Back. We stack him up. No game. And that's the end of the first quarter, folks. It's zero-zero ball game here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. We're going to take a break. They're going to go to the other side of the field from us, David. Yeah. So we're going to depend on the video. We're going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some pirate action. We insure your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. Welcome here to the second quarter. Your Pirates are pushing them backwards. We're trying to get the ball back. It's second and 15 for Tattano County. David, take it away there, old man. All right. Tattano County quarterback, shotgun position there. Takes the snap itself, runs to the right side. We grab him, knock him out. That's hey, old Ed. Ed Williams there. Ed Williams. Iron Man. Hadn't called his name yet tonight. Waiting for double nickel there. Jalen Bennett to fire up. He had a great game the other day. Yes, sir. He sure did. All right. It's, like you say, if you're just joining us, folks, it's 0-0, but it's been a lot of running here. So that's why that clock went quick on that first quarter. No scores yet. Pirates are pinning their ears back and going after these uh, Battle Creek Warriors. You know, you know not to come over to Tattnall. These these young men have played us tough every year that we've played them. They've been in, we're very familiar with Tattnall. They're we've scrappy. played them for 20 plus they years. They will not lay down. 30 years. Be, yeah, they're not going to quit. I can tell you that. They're not going to quit. All right, here we go. Quarter Third and 12. Snap. Hands off to running back on that right side. Knocked out of bounds by Grayson Hall. Flag late. Comes in, in there. That could be a hold. Not sure. They're discussing it. That was a flag way in the back. Hmm. Back there looks like it's a, from a holding angle, but they're, they're face, face masking mask. it. Oh, I was afraid face of that. Mask on Should result in first down for the Warriors. We held them, but they did call the face mask. Yeah, we don't need too many of them. Davids went to sleep on me. No, I'm trying to find some scores around. Yeah. I'm looking I ain't worried about nobody else. We're watching the Pirates, David. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We calling this game, David. Oh, my goodness. 11.40 <laughs> on the clock. I'm trying to give y'all some scores. <laughs> End off over here. Off. Oh, we stack him up. We're going to let him go. Nope. We finally David, corralling you know us. you can't do two things at one time, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> not fourth and ten it is uh no it is actually it is fourth down david the penalty didn't give him enough for the first down that's right i forgot about that see i knew that. that's why i'm looking up scores oh okay yeah, yeah right whatever you can lie to everybody but me say you big dummy <laughs> <laughs> i 
I resemble that remark. <laughs> yeah. All right, it's fourth and three for the Tattle County Warriors. It looks like they're in a punting situation here in the second quarter. The Pirates have failed to put any points on the Who is uh, that board? punting for the Battle Creek Warriors? Can you see a – That is number eight, I believe. number eight. Okay. He was Brandon, Brandon Williams is what I have him listed. We got number 88 in the back here, Kellen Eccles. Kicks up. Uh, he kicks, kicks it off to the, the side. side. Not a pirate inside where he's kicking it off to. Maybe we need to put three back there and, and do that. All right, the Pirates are going to take over on the what yard line there, David? Is that the 40? Right. It's going to be right at the 40. They're going to mark it on the 40. Yes. It is the 40. The Pirates take over. And they are going away from David and I. So David's going to be lost without this video screen. <laughs> hey, it's tough looking at a video screen. <laughs> it's tough for you to walk and chew chew and go. <laughs> All right, fire stake over first oh, and ten from the forty. I uh, cuss for somebody that I can't work it out. I got a back injury. <laughs> All right, Jamarion Williams in the backfield again. Got a heavy dose of him a while ago. Fumble the ball last time. Touch gives it off to Williams again. I bet you they don't catch oh, him now. Oh, he just runs yeah. over a guy. Choo choo, and that's probably a first down. Great tackle by good for a first down. Great tackle by that number six, uh, Trayvon Rogers. But I can tell you what, shame on me once, but shame on me twice. Ain't gonna happen right. with that young man. You get him mad and fired up. Look at that right. Yes, Great sir. Hole. Look at that hole. The truck will come running with the headlights on. All right, here we go. First and 10 again for the Pirates from the 30. Jamarion Williams, the truck in the backfield. Seven man front. They hand off again. He's got some room. Side. He's looking for a block. He's got a block out there still on his feet. Kellen get a little shove there, but right into uh, near side. to Williams. Again, they are going on the 20. Is that a first? No. That's on the 20. That's second and one. Good nine-yard okay. run for the Pirates. Clock's a ticking. We're running the ball, so that's what's getting the uh, clock to go down so fast on us. All right, we're getting set again. Mason Griffiths trying to get seven, them in. Seven men on the line. There's a snap. Hands oh. off to a. Here he goes. He's, He's got, got room. Him. He could go. He's still, He's still on, on his feet. feet. He's driving, lunges forward. The ball hits the ground and bounces out of, bounds. out of bounds. He was lunging, twine, trying to get it over the line. There's that number six with the tackle again, Trayvon Rogers. Man, they got there quick, ain't they? First and a about a yard. About, about, I think it's first and two yards. No, I think it's one yard, David. You can't see the screen that far. I was trying to look at the. <laughs> trying to look at. You're the, blind up close and far away. To look at the yard marker <laughs> what they had, but he had to have it stretched out. I guess I don't know. All right, it's first and goal for the Pirates. Uh, let's see what we're going to dial up here. Snap, hands off to Williams. Bust it through, and he's That's in, I believe. And it's a touchdown. touchdown, Pirates! Boom. <laughs> That's six to nothing for your Pirates here in the first quarter with 8.35 on the clock on your Village Pizza scoreboard. And one of our number man, number one men kicked the extra point, Alan Bereza Ramirez. Alan wears number 22 for the Pirates. I wanted to run him down tonight before the game. Didn't get a chance I want to see you run. I want to see me run. I roll. I don't run. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here we go. Set. There's a snap. High snap. Hold. Kick is up. Right and down the good. middle from here. That makes it 7 to nothing for your Pirates. <laughs> Folks, we're going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group and Baxter. And are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. Healthy 
Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. All right. Welcome back, Pirate fans. Pooch kicked by Alan Ramirez. No No fair catch called. But there's a host of pirates in there just a banging and hitting pretty hard on a young man. Helmet comes off of him. But I think the ball's going to be on the 30. That was number 33, uh, and Andre Anderson, senior for the uh, Tattano County Battle Creek Warriors. Five, he's showing him at 5'10", 235. Yes, sir. Ball spotted on the 30-yard line for Tattano County. Thank you, Becky Vonador. I tried my best with the cannon. <laughs> and I'm trying to keep David awake over here tonight. You know, it's past his bedtime. And he they got know, out of whack not being there last week. You know, we talked about the cannon and stuff. We went over to Camden County last year to bit on an off night to watch them play, and they got a little bitty tiny cannon. Now, we understand now why people jump. We're used to ours. But that little thing fired off over the line scared us to death. No, it scared you. No, it scared you. I scared all of us. <laughs> it did. We wasn't expecting. I didn't know they had a cannon over there. Yeah. Not They're a the little thing like that. A little bitty thing, too. All right. They're getting in a bunch here again. Remain in motion over here. They Hand throw it to the outside. He's got a little room. We try to get him. Finally is that number out of six? That, that is, is number man. six. That's Trayvon Rogers playing both ways. I figured they'd be playing a little bit of Iron Man football tonight there, David. You know something, David, and I, I haven't had a chance to talk about this. I wanted to before the, um, this got going. I uh, was watching something on Facebook, and I follow most all the local teams around. Uh, but something that really touched my heart is I got to watch some of these young men from Tattanoe get baptized. And yes, to, I saw that. That and, was awesome. And to me, that right there is bigger than any football game yes. that ever ever happened. That uh, was that was awesome. That that's was, that's me speaking, and, uh, and yes, I'll say I, that I saw that. That was awesome. All right, here it is. It's second and six for Tattano. There's a snap. Hands off to the running back. He's looking right side. Oh, and a host of pirates there. Number eleven, Nehemiah Howard, and number fifteen, Ray Sean. Ray Sean, the real deal. Moore pushes him out of bounds for a loss. Read it all the way. Trey Sean right there. You see, he was looking for it the whole time, and they just run it lateral, run him out of bounds. Great job by your Pirates. All right, they're taking their time. Got a few people, personnel coming in and out. Okay. did get an update a while ago. Uh, Pierce was up on uh, by, uh, by day in the first uh, quarter, 14-7. Toombs is playing who tonight? They're playing uh, uh, Windsor Forest. Windsor Forest, I believe it is. I believe that's correct. All right, it's third and ten. The Pirates are trying to hold here. Another handoff to the right. Look who's back there. The Bulldozer. Number 55, the Bulldozer. Tackles for another loss on number seven, Xavier Friendly. Two great athletes here for Tattano County. Bennett had him a – not last Saturday. Last yes, Friday sir. Night. I mean, he. Rolling you exactly right. Roland Jackson, one of our old longtime pirate. Uh, big pirate man. you exactly right, my friend. They have been up tonight. They they have showed a lot of fortitude on this field tonight uh, with our pirates. They uh, have not let up, and uh, I like seeing that. All right. Tattano County to punt. Looks like we may be going after him. And we didn't. We held back. Flags come in from everywhere. There's the punt. That's the first time I've seen him kick it down the middle to us. Yeah. Not sure what's called. Was it a motion? Tattano signal and it's on us and it is on us. Make a substitution. Should be only a five yard. We had a legal substitution. I'm swatting this. Yes, an illegal substitution. So that's going to move them up a little bit closer. Still going to be fourth down. They're still yeah, back give in a punting situation here. Give them back five yards there. Should make it fourth and eight. Kellen Eccles. Can't have too many more of those. I 
think everybody's set and ready now, Chris. I think we're fixed to play football again. There's a snap. Good blocking kick. by Tad. Nope. High kick. Kelly Nichols calls for a fair catch. Drops yeah. the ball but lays down on it. Fair catch signal. Ball was kind of wobbly in the air, man. I, it kind of yeah, kind of made a fade there. We're going to stay here because the offense is getting right on the field. They're wanting to score. It's going to bring up uh, first and 10 on the 40 for the Pirates. And they are going the opposite way from David and I. Like we said, we are here in the uh, backside of the end zone here at Tattanoe County. Actually, we're in a pretty good spot right here. We like are, this. man. This is nice. Love their facility over here. All right, let's see what the Pirates got in store. We still got a two-man wide over here to the left side. Dason's going to hand, hand off, off again. There's a man that come across there. Who was that that tackled? Uh, I don't know. Somebody got him from behind. I think he got a gain of five. I didn't see his number there, David. I, I apologize. Either. Somebody grabbed him from behind. If not, I think he got even, probably had a first down on that. Yes, sir. But somebody grabbed a hold of him and slowed him down, was dragging Gain of six makes it second and four for the Pirates from the 40, 45 yard line. It's 5 13 here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. Pirates lead seven to nothing. So Marion Willis still in the backfield. There's the snap. Hand oh, Dason pulls, oh, it. Dason He's pulls running. it. He's looking for running room. He's hit. Did he get but enough I for think a first he down? He got a first down. I believe you're right. Dason's one of the best in the business with doing that. He he fooled you in a heartbeat. Uh, he fooled me every time, I can promise you. That's not hard for you, though, them old eyes. Here's <laughs> another look at it right here. Now you can really see it, David. <laughs> Fakes it. Jamarion does a good job right here. I'm waiting for that young man to put his head down and hit somebody. I know he's got it in him. Oh, yeah. All right, it's first and 10 for the Pirates on the 50, excuse me, 49-yard line, 48-yard line. There's the snap. Hands off to Williams. He's running over people, still pushing forward. What a job by Jamari in the truck. Williams, first down, I believe. Williams, another nice carry. Brought down by. Not, it's a second and one or two. Second down. Yep. It's hard to tell where we're at right here, but. What you see at home, we see. Yeah. <laughs> and they're going away from us, so. Want to thank the folks watching here tonight. Another handoff. Hand off to Williams. Oh, he's That's got some room. Got he's still on man. his feet. Here he go. Stiff arming people. Oh, my on goodness. First down, Pirates. Run all the way down to the 15-yard line. That's a good 36-yard line. Huh? Was that a 26-yard run? Oh, yeah. Great job by Jamar in the truck. Wow. Great blocking up front. Look who's in the backfield now. Number four, Ed Williams. Ed Williams. Now, this is a handful here, too. You ain't lying. Now, that young man right there is a well, good looking. Oh, he gets the ball. Williams spins. Good lunges. tackle there. Gain of four, maybe five. Good sportsmanship there Ed by the Pirates. Williams on the carry there. It's a couple yards. Second down. That Clocks. number 70 is a monster, ain't he? I wish I had his name. We ain't, we don't have him on our show. No, sir. I'm, I'm going to try our halftime to see if I can get a better roster. All right, Pirates throw one over here to the left Jack side. Kellen Eccles. Host of Battle Creek Warriors over there tackling him. Close to a first down. Short, uh, maybe by a yard. Gets that ball, brings it down. It'll be third and short. Kellen with that long reach had to jump up and grab it. Kellen, tall, athletic kid. Got to talk to his dad earlier. Uh, just a great man. Uh, really enjoy speaking with oh, him. Oh, yeah. Uh, I know he's proud of this young man, and uh, he's been over here since his ninth grade year, and mm -hmm. uh, just a joy to have him here. He, he, he loves, loves it. He love loves it. He's got great friends on the field, and that's what it's about, David. It is. It really is. All right, here we go. That's Hand that. off. Jamari that's Williams Jamar. puts his head down. That's a first down. Should be first and goal. All right, I'm going to have to get on number 58 a little bit, old Leggett. He's doing a great job for our Pirates. He did a great job there on his blog. I said get on to him. I need to uh, commend him for what he did. <laughs> you pancakes somebody? I get on to you. I'll commend him. <laughs> get on to me. 
All right, it's first and goal for the Pirates from around the four-yard line. Number 61 of uh, the Pirates, Rhett Stone, Lionheart. Kid has fought hard to be where he's at out there. He, he has uh, had a few injuries uh, in the past uh, three years and has fought hard to get back where he's at and has earned every second he's been on that field. Griffiths with a quick throw, snapping a throw to the corner. Kellen Eccles threw his hands. Good number four defending there. That is Cam, Cam Davis. Davis. Great job by him. Here's a replay on it. Snapping a quick just up throw over there and let jump jump ball right through the hands. They're letting them be handsy tonight, so yep. there's nothing wrong with that. Yep. Hey, let, let you get away with it, do it, right? Good defense. He was covered great well. Ball was thrown in a – We got a lot of folks spot. watching us tonight from Columbus. We want to give a shout-out to all the fans and all the Lady Pirates over there. Hands off all right. And he's Bulls in for a waiting. touchdown. Pirates. Boom. <laughs> Makes it 13 to nothing for you, Pirates. <laughs> I get a little excited on it, David. Yeah, this booming over here. <laughs> I need my cannon, brother. <laughs> but I really want to give a huge shout-out to all those folks down there in Columbus. Columbus uh, watching our Lady Pirates and cheered them on. Y'all give them some extra shouts tomorrow for That's me right. and David. Uh, neither of the two of us will be able to make it, but uh, we, we – you're always in our heart, and you're always, uh, you know, missing one. Well, I say second biggest fan. All right, we've got to kick the extra point here. Alan Ramirez. That's a snap. The hold, the kick is up. And, and it's good. right down the middle. All right, yeah. Pirate fans, your Pirates are leading 14 to nothing here in the second quarter with a minute and 25 on your Village Pizza scoreboard. We're going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. ensures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. All right, welcome back Pirate fans. Pirates are going to be kicking off to the Tattano County Battle Creek Warriors. A nice deep high deep. kick over here. Young man catches it. Fielded around the 15. Looking for some running room. We He's hit him still on his around. feet. I don't know if I'd kick it Ooh, to this young man again or not. <laughs> he is toting some pirates there. Huge it kid. Looks like uh, Cameron Jordan. Who not number, number 33. Jamarcus Robinson come up with the ball, but that's that Andre Anderson running the ball. That's a, a load to tote and a load to get down. Boy, he's a big kid. I don't think I'd kick it back to him again. <laughs> All right, it's uh, 14 to nothing here in the second quarter on your Village Pizza scoreboard. First and 10 for the Tattano County Battle Creek Warriors on the 34-yard line. The ball's spotted. Cheryl Martin, it says, uh, Cheryl Martin says not able to be there tonight, but uh, son Jordan Todd, number 71, says go Pirates. There's a flag comes in. Let's see what we have here. Legal substitution, maybe? Twelve men on the field. Men on the field. Oh, goodness. For Tattnall. Uh, it's going to cost him five yards. Makes it first and 15 with a minute 15. This will be the opportunity where they're going to probably try and throw the ball on us, so we got to be ready for anything. Uh, they better be to the line real quick. we got number 16 back, uh, Jamarcus Robinson. Number two, Michael Creighton. Quarterback keeps it. Right up the middle, and he's tackled. Cameron Namobli in there uh, trying to get to Damn, him. Pirates are going to call a timeout. I think they're going to try and hold him and get the ball back and try to score again. Yep. We have a timeout. We're, happening. We're going to take a break with him, guys. We'll be right back with some pirate action.
insure your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. This is a minute and nine seconds here in the second quarter. Pirates lead 14 to nothing here on the Village Pizza scoreboard. Cole finally got back fast enough for us to watch the football. <laughs> I pick it Cole a whole lot. Cole's probably the most awesome person in this whole yeah, group. Quarterback takes the snap and runs forward. Looks like you may have another timeout called here. Yes, yeah, looks like the Pirates are going to call timeout, trying to keep the clock here. Get some short yardage. We have another timeout by Appleton County. We're gonna uh, we're gonna stay here with him, David. Cole, Cole didn't get us in time. I, I didn't close us out where he could take and get rid of us. No, you was over there giving hand signals or something. Well, I was trying to wake you up. No, it wasn't at me. I don't know what you was waving at over there. What, you, you don't even know what's what going you on. Ordering cheeseburgers or something. I'm trying to, and you won't even get us one. You had some money. I mean, you even had to give your child money you, a while ago. You, you owe me twenty dollars, by the way. You ordering cheeseburgers. You owe me twenty because I That's give right. him ten. I hope you didn't. <laughs> Yeah, yeah right. after I went to the Rusty yeah, Pig. Yeah, he went baby. to Rusty Pig without us. <laughs> hey, Jamie, I went to Rusty Pig without him. <laughs> yeah. I can't get off work in time. You go, y'all go. got to be over early and set up. He's over eating barbecue. <laughs> now, I, now I know why your wife <laughs> kicks you out of the house, you whiner. <laughs> whiner. <laughs> Good Lord. All right, Fires got their time out here trying to keep the clock here where they can try and get the ball back with some time on there to try and score. A uh, minute and five seconds here, third and 12. Pirates have one timeout left here in this first half. Tattano County is trying to get set real quick. Here we go, David, take it away, buddy. All right, it's third and 12. Different little setup here. Quarterback takes snap. He's rolling out to his left, trying to look. Oh, throw. my goodness. The ball's, the ball's been fumbled. The and the Pirates, Pirates have, it. have it. And a flag comes in. Carry far side ball. And another, another late flag. flag. Bunch of flags on the play. Let's see what we got. I think this may be a face mask. Could be. Be a terrible call for us after trying to get the ball back there and had an opportunity yep, for face it. Face yep. mask on face us. Mask on Looked like he had all arms on that to me, David. I think it must have been. Usually don't replay one of these, but. Uh, I missed Let's it. Let's see what the guy did, too. I didn't see a face mask there. I didn't see there. a face mask. I seen the ball pop out. I did, too. The officials are going to talk it over. I think where they're going to spot the ball at. It's probably going to be a first and uh, 12. It does give them a first down. Yep, first and 12, I believe. Or first and – I don't know what they're going to call here, David. Hang on. Now they're marking it off. Face mask. Was it enough for a first down, or was And he just signaled third down. I don't know what that was. Third and what there, David? We're trying to get the clock set. And it is third down, and we're trying time to. Timeout, Appling County. Take their final timeout on half. So it's third and six. All right. We're going to take a break with them, guys. We're going to get our clock straightened out, and we'll be right back with some pirate action. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. All right, welcome back Pirate fans. It's third and six. Uh, Pirates did slap the ball away, but uh, Face mask penalty, uh, give it back to him. Makes it third and six for him. Got to give a big shout out to old Sherrod Roberts. He's one of the guys we were talking about earlier. That's watched right. this from Dubai when Sherrod was playing for the Pirates. Missed that young man. 
fine young man. Tatton with the snap. Quarterback's going to keep it, run around Oh, the right and side. he's still in playing without his without his helmet on. That's usually a flag. Yep. No call by the officials. Anytime the, the helmet comes off, he's supposed to play stop Tattle, dead. Tattle's coaches were. But it's okay. They're not going to call anything. It's fourth and six. Looks like the Pirates. Uh, Clock is running. Could get the ball back here, but I think they're going to let it run down. Yeah, this may be it for the half here. We'll see what happens. Not sure about the play clock, though, David. We don't see one here to look at. Yeah, I don't see one either. They must be keeping it on the field. I think they may have to still kick it off to us. Or they may go for it. Nope, they're going to take the penalty. Yep. Leave eight seconds left on the clock. So they are going to take uh, that penalty. So Pirates are going to bring somebody back. Like Kellen Eccles going to be our man back deep. We're trying to run personnel on and off the field. Get it straight here. Both teams running people off. Yeah, well, I, 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 I know it's kind of. Clock says 10 seconds. Uh, it's fourth and 17 for Tattnall. Officials asked to reset the clock to 10 seconds. You must be keeping the play clock on. The field. Yeah, I don't see a play clock here at this either. field, so that has to be done on the field. See what the Pirates can do here. All right, I think everybody's set now. Do you go after it, David? Well, I would think so. We're lining up like we're going to. And we don't. Kick back deep. Kellen calls fair catch. And... That leaves enough time on the clock for the Pirates to at least get one play off here. We're going to try to throw one deep here. And they are going to be playing away from us, though, David. Dason has the arm to throw it. Oh, my goodness, does he? What do we've got up, up our sleeves here, David, is what I'd like to see. Yep. Do we take a knee? We're getting the ball anyways. Yeah. Let's see what the second half. You do have two over here to the right side. But we're... And you got not the truck. setting up in a victory formation by no means. No, sir. And they're, they're not going to play too deep back on us. You know you're going to have to run a go route if you're going to throw long. Four men on the line. And There's we are set up He's for dropping it. back to look. Look. He steps up. Oh, he throws it deep. He's back there. Got a man. Oh, Kelly Nichols has got it, but it's oh, short. It's just short. Oh, my goodness gracious. What a throw and catch by Dason. Wow. Brought down by number two, Isaac Brown. Wow, what a throw. Man. Two just. Almost had him. Two inches close. The boys two are coming our way. Up. I know they wanted that touchdown, but <laughs> hey. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right, your Pirates are uh, leading here 14 to nothing on your Village Pizza scoreboard. Folks, we're going to take a break because we're going to come back unedited and let that awesome Pirate uh, Brigade get on the field. These young men are coming by us. Our Pirate football team, proud of them. There's Edwin Burt, little small guy. And Trey number Sean 15, Moore. Trajan Moore. <laughs> Who's that? that? I, look at that. He's wearing the wrong jersey number. I see that. <laughs> you know who that is. That's number 57 wearing 40, Wesley Hendricks. And Eccles with a great catch. Yes, sir. Well, folks, we I guess we're going to stay live, aren't we, Cole? Yep. We're gonna we, gonna see you're not going to hear the Pirate fans, or you're not going to hear David and I, so here comes the Pirate Brigade, the number one band in the country in my eyes. That's right. All right, folks, David and I are going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. Allison Morley and Reagan Carter. Staff assistants Aaron Rattler, Samantha Rattler, and Kenny Cross. The brigade is under the field direction of drum major Sidney K. Ropey. Ladies and gentlemen, the 2023 Sound of Silver Grand 
champions, the Pirate Brigade.
Ladies and gentlemen, welcome, welcome to another halftime half performance brought to you by the Tattano County, County Board, Board of Education. Education. On behalf of Superintendent Dr. Dr. Kristen Waters and, and Principal Justin Flowers, Tattano County, County High School, School proudly, proudly presents the Sound of Pride, Pride Marching Band. Band. The band is under the direction of Mr. Dylan Lynch, Assistant Directors of Jeff Atkinson and Nick Justice. Color Guard Director is Jennifer Davenport. On the field, the band is led by drum major Amir Sharp and band captain Kale Coimas. Tonight, the band presents its 2023 show entitled Coast to Coast. Music selections include California Love, Mississippi Queen, House of the Rising Sun, 25 or 6 to 4, and Empire State of Mind. The band will compete in the East Georgia Marching Championships tomorrow at Statesboro High School at 3 p.m. Come out and support your music athletes. Senior drum major Amir Sharp, is your band ready? You may take the field in halftime performance.
after it, I think it'll turn. You do one of the only Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. your small business because it isn't small to you that's simple human sense ask james m swain and associates in baxley and hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you your car because some people never learn to park that's simple human sense ask rents and rents insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, 
providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy. All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. We're in the third quarter. We're fixing to get the kickoff going. Tooms kicks a deep one over here. That's kind of up close. Oh, we got a runner here. Number That's six for the Kinsley. Pirates. He's got a running he got lane. Running room. He's still on his feet. Oh, he's tackled from behind there, David. Crosses midline. Out to about the 47. 53, David. 53, <laughs> just short of the 53-yard line. <laughs> <laughs> All right, folks. Pirates take it over here first down on the 47-yard line. Pirates are getting ready and lined up. Pirates lead 14 to nothing here in the Village Pizza scoreboard. All right. Jamarion Williams in the backfield with Griffiths. Griffiths takes the snap. He's looking to throw, looking to throw. He's got a man over in the middle, throws it. Oh, falling down. Who was that, Killing Eccles? Yep, that was Killing Eccles there, falling down on the pass. Chris Gunn, guess who's here tonight? I got to talk to him earlier. Who's that? Trevor and Toby Taylor. Yeah, I did too. I got yeah. <laughs> Your brother, Kevin Williams, having to come mess with somebody. Yeah, I did. I also got to talk to them. They're over here on the fence now. Yep. Uh, two of my favorite guys. Their yep. uncle's all right. Jeremy Bates, you know. <laughs> we were talking about Jeremy. I won't tell Jeremy what we said about him. There's a snap. Hand off. And they hit us in the backfield. We had somebody, right at the line of scrimmage went down, and back up. Awesome Some about it down. Loss of brain. Loss of brain. <laughs> By David Heron. <laughs> but we're talking to our big old police chief over here. We need to get him on here one day. You think? I don't know if he would. He's too shy. <laughs> he is. All right. Brings up third and 15 for the Pirates. Clocks are ticking. Got two men to the left. There's a snap. Griffiths looking to throw, looking to throw. Steps up in the pocket, runs around to his right. Got a man chasing him. Runs out of bounds. Pushed out of bounds right at the uh, original line of scrimmage there, David. Robinson again. Bring it forward. Pirates and a good stop. Uh, quick Fire fourth down. Tatton will come out and stop this right off the bat. Yes, sir. That's not what we were looking to happen, looking no. to see happen. Pirates have been a little flat tonight there, David. I think we're doing some stuff, changing some people up, some personnel. Got some people trying to heal up. Griffiths to punt, and he can kick it a ton. Kicks it. Wobbly low. Oh, and Good it gets bounce. a pirate bounce. Can we get down Can to we get it? Down? I, oh, oh, what a play. What a job. Who was that? That's number 19. Hashtag himself, Grayson Hall. Grayson Hall making a play. So, what would have been a touchback? It's a good stop. Great job by Grayson. All that speed come from Mama. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> good job by Grayson. See where the ball is going to be. Grayson's placed. also one of those. On the two. I believe that's uh, the two-yard line, David. Yep. The hashtags are a little light tonight. It's hard to see. Playing on natural grass tonight. Hash marks, not hashtag. Hashtag was on the two. Yeah, I was like. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Them are some good-looking uniforms that Tatno County has. I like them. You know, you're a fashionist? I am now. Football fashionist. Fashion designer. Fashion design. I didn't design them. <laughs> but they look good, though. All right, looks like we got a legal substitution on there. Maybe a timeout called. Yeah, it is. Uh, got a timeout by Tattnall County. Uh, Cole, we're going to stay with them. You want to take a break? We're going to take a break. We'll be right back with some pirate action. Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy.
right. Welcome back, Fire fans. Hey, we've been picking at each other pretty hard. Tampa yeah, County's got it on the two-yard line. Got man in motion. Quarterback, Quarterback keeps it. Gain of about two there. Stuffed hard in there by Edwin Burt. And looks like uh, he's going to get about three off of that. Big 51, the boogeyman in there, Jacquez Van, and number 55, Jalen, the bulldozer Bennett. Time before they gain about uh, three yards there. Trying to move it out of that end zone. Call some of these Tatlin County players Jordan Williams, number 68, 6'3, 310 pounds. That's small. Man. I got him beat. <laughs> yeah. On the weight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not the height. <laughs> Hey, here we go. It's 9.45 on the Village Pizza scoreboard. Pirates leading 14 to nothing. Tatano County trying to get out of their own end zone. Pirates are trying to hold them. Quarterback again, keep it. We got him close to the oh, end zone. Oh, it looks like we got him. Jaylen but not Bennett for, threw him back, but I think he's out he was, of the end zone. He was about on the one-yard line. So about the one. On the keeper. Does get the nose of the ball out of the end zone. Ball will be on the one-yard line. Pirates rushed in there pretty quick. They they gained uh, three yards and lost four there, David. Yeah, Jalen Bennett, Bennett read it all the way and just grabbed him and slung him down. Hard to guard that young man. You know that? Have you stood beside him just realized how big he is? Yeah, I figured out that I was prettier but not bigger. Do you realize how big he is? <laughs> <laughs> all right, here we go. Third and 13 for the Pirates. Uh, trying to hold uh, Tattnall County here. Yeah, we got them pinned back deep. Quarterback Quarter keeps it again, again, and a host of Pirates there to the stuff him. Scrimmage. It's a dangerous spot to be in for Tattano County. Again. And again, number 45, and the Pirates have finally got a little pep in their step. Trying to hold these Battle Creek Warriors. It's going to be fourth down and 13. 13. Look at this right here. Look at just the line just collapse on it. Yes, sir. What a job by that defensive line for the Pirates. This is a uh, rough situation to be in. Backed up, your heels are on the the uh, back line. Yep. Who we got back? Got to get. Got to get the ball off quick. You got a stream of pirates coming at you, and we screaming and hollering, and hollering, and hollering. Urgh. <laughs> See if we're gonna go after him this time. Nope. No, no. They're gonna let it go. Kicks right to Kellen. Oh, Kellen, Kellen misses the ball. Down, flag down. He's back on it. No, that wasn't a flag. That was a beanbag. Oh, was it? Yeah, they're trying to mark it. <laughs> and uh, I just seen something come flying across. I looked up off of the screen and saw something flying. And I'm like, <laughs> that was your brain. It was a beanbag. They're playing cornhole in the middle of a football game. <laughs> I apologize, folks. I, I have been Who's on winning? a roll. <laughs> yeah, hey, I've been on a roll. I, I want to explain this, folks. Number 40 tonight, it kind of confused me and David tonight. He come by us and. With a big old smile on his face. He wears number 57, Wesley Hendricks. Look at this right here. We're going to the hammer. Jamar oh, wow. He takes a snap. He runs. He's got some running room, and he's pushing and pulling and dragging folks first with down. him. What a job by the truck. Number one, Jamarian Williams. Number 24, right here, there's a replay on it. Takes a snap. Look at the hole. Look at the block in there. Ed Williams. And then you Man. got your center there coming along, number 61, Rhett Stone. Got Ed Williams blocking for him there. And Cameron George, yep. number 18. Same setup. Oh, he moves to the, the outside. Puts his head down and runs over a guy. Yep, our receiver got a little behind the, uh, the, the defensive guy. Numbers. He could have blocked him. I think Jamarian could have cut it up. That was number six on tackle, Trayvon Rogers. Yes, We've sir. been saying his name a lot Second tonight. Called Great it a lot. Athlete. I'm going to tell you what, Tatano County has some athletes. Great athletes. Four-yard uh, gain there for the Pirates. Got him out there on the island, uh, Kellen Eccles, being guarded by one man. It's man-to-man -man over there. Okay, who are we taking the snap now? This is oh, that's Creighton. Creighton with a carry. That's the first Good time this year. Creighton. Good game. Running Maybe, what, about hammer. two yards, three yep. yards? Haven't seen that all year. Creighton not as big, but I tell you what, he is hard to handle. Yes, sir. He is excitement. Who we got back there? Is that, that him again? Yeah, Creighton's still on the field. Sure is. Tell you what, you give that young man a hole, and if he can get it, oh, he can yeah. be gone. Yeah, he's fast. He's quick. He's um, 
we've seen some real exciting things out of this kid. All right, it's and third and three for the Pirates. Trying to get a first down. Creighton with the snap. Oh, he's got a hole over here, but Bounces he cuts it off, out. Spins to the outside. Got a flag in here. Flag comes in. Yeah, that's around the territory Creighton of holding. See what the flag's going to be. It is in the vicinity of Holden, but. And it is Holden on yeah. Appling County. You know, David, it, it, that's a call that could be just about called on every play. You know, I've heard that by many coaches uh, both ways. Uh, well, you, you get your hands on the outside, they're going to call it on you every that's right. time. You it's know, positioning where you're at. I mean, it is. You know, and. Uh, that's and these officials have done a great yeah, job. Yeah, Lord, tonight. yeah, they have yeah, done a been fantastic job. Very good. You got to get away from those penalties, though, yeah, for us. You know, they're calling it straight on both ends. And, yes, sir. Third and, and uh, thirteen for the Pirates here, though. Jamarion Williams back in the ball game to take the snap. He takes the snap. Oh, oh my hands off goodness! To Creighton, they end around. The Can he make it for running room? Oh, and a little horse collar, but no Rassel call down there. Around the 20. I'll tell you what, that's number six, uh, Trayvon Rogers. Trayvon Rogers. Trayvon Rogers here near side. Seen number two in there, Isaac Brown. Will that make it fourth and six? And on comes the kicker. Kudos to our defense. They play some tough football. They should replay right here. It's Creighton. He was a block away of putting this in a way. Yes, sir. That was now, a, look, well, we're going to go for a field goal here. What's that? He's on around the 28-yard uh, line. That's a 38-yard field goal yeah, attempt. This is, and we've seen him make it a little bit longer than this. Alan Ramirez has snapped the hold. The kick is up. Man, that's perfect. And it's good. Right down the middle. Field goals, good. Boom. 17-0. to Your Pirates lead here on the Village Pizza scoreboard. He's about one more boom of me dumping him out this year. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got to do something for our Pirates. All right, folks, we're going to take a break. It's 17 to nothing. Your Pirates lead here on the Village Pizza scoreboard. Here in the third quarter, we'll be right back with some Pirate action. Auto Owners ensures your small business because it isn't small to you. That's simple human sense. Ask James M. Swain and Associates in Baxley and Hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. They're in a hurry. Pirates kick a low bouncing kick, bouncing kick, fielded at the 10. Back coming to his right side. Cuts oh, back what a good job to get off his block. Number 19, Grayson Hall. But a great run by number six, Trayvon Rogers. That young man's just a do-it-all player for them. Yeah, he's everywhere. They got another old uh, pirate joining us here tonight, John David Black. John David. Yes, hey, sir. Buddy. 2017 young man. Listen to this. Mr. Brian Morris is one of our faithful watchers. Watching all the way from Southern California, saying, let's go Pirates. All like we right. say, Pirate, Pirate always, Pirate for life. All right, it's uh, 17 to nothing well, here. Look at this configuration we got going on here. They've got four guys out to the left. Quarterback's going to keep it run to the right, the short side of the field, knock him out of bounds. About a six or seven yard gain. They're trying to spread us out there. David and catching yep. us off guard, trying to use some of that speed. Looked like a man wasn't set over there on that bunch over there. Looked like he moved. Kind of, uh, yeah, that was um, – Caught my eyes the reason I'm, I'm saying that. I'm going to tell you that. what, this Tattle County team has showed us so many different looks. I, man, I'm not lying. They have thrown everything yeah, at us. Here to go with that same look and got one three-man front. Flag comes in. Flag on the play before the snap. The legal substitution maybe? Uh, it's on them, but I didn't see the. I didn't see the see. legal substitution. That's what it was. Is it? Got one too many men in the, in there. Yep, they did. They had one too many there. You can't do that. Nope. <laughs> Got to have eleven, not twelve. Doing that, Chris Floyd math. No, that's David math. David Heron math. <laughs> 
I All right, it's second and eight uh, now for Tattnall. Again, same funky bunch over here. Three man front, four guys over there. They were moving. And I see if that's the call. Whistle blows. See what the call was there. Yep. And they what do you moving. call that formation, David? A bunch to the left. <laughs> a bunch to the left. Yeah. <laughs> and a small bunch in the middle? Yeah. A, a, small, <laughs> and a, shorter, a smaller bunch in the middle. <laughs> Offensive line left. Another penalty on them. Makes it second and 13. Well, I've uh, seen the, they had them four guys out there, and I've seen them moving around <laughs> when the ball was. Haven't seen a lot of this, but I'll tell you what, you better eyeball over here number 33 because that, that's a force to be reckoned with for Tattnall. That young man oh, is a. Uh, Ooh. Quick throw of our screen. They got blocking out front. He's got running room. He's trying to get around the corner. This kid's quick. He's out of bounds, David. Yep. Friendly. No uh, call. I had a feeling that that play was fixing to come alive here in a minute. Takes a snap real quick. Screen. Big game, yeah. Good blocking by Tattano County. Mikhail Creighton gets him and just kind of shoves him out. Got to get off those blocks to get those tackles, though, David. Yeah, they, they set that up just right. And they're, they're throwing everything but the kitchen sink at yeah. us right now. They're still in that funky bunch. It's a weird formation. I, I really don't know what it's called. Quarterback keeps it hit by Jalen Bennett and a host of others. The boogeyman the says no way. And Burt was in there. And there comes late, the flag late flag. late. Probably a little extracurricular. Let's see what we got here. He looks like he's pointing toward the Pirates. Yeah, that's probably a little. Yep. Unsportsmanlike. like against the Pirates. That's going to be a first down. I don't know who that was on. I uh, don't either. It was away from the ball. It looks like. I don't think there's anything on the sideline. Now they're going to run that formation to the other side. They got they're five coming. over there, they David. Sure do. This is Actually, there's five men in the back. Uh, there's a snap. There's that screen. They're blocking, but we didn't get fooled that time. We hit him. And that's Nehemiah Howard with the tackle. Yeah, Treshawn Moore was up in there. Ball is on the 20. They ain't going away from that bunch, though, I can tell you. No. That's an odd look. <laughs> Brian's got my back. He said he, he's confident that my math's better than yours. <laughs> we got better training than you did back in 1901. Hey, you leave our dad gum <laughs> little thing with the little. All right, second on seven. It. They're still in this uh, funky formation. Don't know what to call this. Quarterback out of the shotgun. Takes a snap. Oh, and he low picks it up. It bounced off his knees. Oh, and a late push there. So that's going to be ten in. flags coming out. They late, late, late uh, push there. There was so many flags coming in. I thought it was a surprise birthday party. You thought you were at the laundromat is what you thought. I didn't know what was going on. I don't think that was intentional. Well, no, it was late, though. It was after it the was, whistle was yeah, blown. Yeah, it was after the whistle, and it's just one of them things that happened. I don't think it was – being meant to be a no 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 you know, no no you, you know not but, at all but I think they've had a little extra curricular so it's calm things down a little bit. You got to keep your mind in the game. But that's that's one of the things when the whistles blow, stop. Yeah. That's part of it. Um, you know. But you lock down your focus. I mean, Tattano County kid. I don't think it was on Tattano County. I don't. Just by the looks of it, it looked like he was just trying to block hard, and the whistle was blue, and he was just <coughs> still battling. Here it is in the third quarter, minute 44. The clock's running. Pirates lead 17 to nothing. 
Patnell's throwing man. something at us we ain't never seen before. Uh, not even sure what to call this offense. Stacked up on the short side of the field. There's a snap. And He's it. looking to throw. Throws a little bit. He screen. does. He throws but a little we screen. Bat, we hit him. That we was that big 33, over. too, sure David. It was. That's the one we were worried about. The offset tackle set to this near side, sniffed out by Affleck, to bring up a fourth down for Tattle. All right, it's fourth and 24 for Tattnall. It looks like they're going to bring in the punting unit. And we've got number 88, Kellen Eccles. I got to speak with him at halftime and told him, I said, uh, Camden said he would have scored that. <laughs> uh, what did he say? He <laughs> you know, Kellen laughed. He said, he said, you're right. He's got that speed. Uh, he could have done it. He said, I don't have that He's track got speed. He's speed, too. He but I, I was joking with him, and he, he laughed with me. And I said, no, nah, you had that, buddy. I said, just, you know. Just had to slow down a little bit, and the kid covered him well. A great know. throw, great catch. You know, that's sure. yards. That's, you know, that's something you look forward to. Snaps good. Kicks off over here to the side. Yeah, good one. Fair Kellen's. catch called by Kellen Eccles. Oh, He's and it gets it a pirate bounce. bounce. Great job by Kellen. Wave it off. Pirates will take over on the 30-yard line. They're going to go away from us. There's 10 seconds left on this clock. and should get one playoff here, David, yeah, before we so. go into fourth. Then they'll turn around and come back towards us. Yes, sir. Maybe they'll come see us and wave at us on a few touchdowns. That would be nice right here in the corner. All right. Pirates are going to take over going away from us. Griffiths back in at quarterback. Not sure what's going on. The head, head man's over there speaking to somebody. Not sure who. Yeah. And he blows the whistle for the play to start. The clock won't start until the ball snapped. Those folks at home, we just got possession back. Looks like we got Jamari in. Griffiths might be in a throwing situation here. Takes a snap. He's looking. He oh, throws. and it's thrown short on the ground in a late hit there. Flag looked like it come in. Did I see a flag? No, I don't think you did, David. That was probably one of the worst throws I've ever seen out of him. It was straight to the ground. It but I may have been because he was getting hit there. You think? Yeah, there was somebody coming in on him pretty hard. I didn't hard. see that. And I won't take from Dason by no means because that young man's got a killer arm. But he, he may have got disrupted on that one. Griffiths with the snap, hands off to Williams. Williams on his feet, driving, still driving, going. driving. They're snatching at the ball. He's got a first down, I think. I he's think right he's a little short. It. He's right on. Let's see where the mark's going to be. Yep, they're going to. Well, we're not sure. I know it's uh, at the end of the yep, third quarter. They wave the chains on. It's first down. It is going to be first down for the Pirates when we come back to the fourth quarter. Folks, we're going to take a break. Your Pirates lead 17 to nothing here on your Villa's Pizza scoreboard. Your awesome band playing for them. We're going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. Insure your car because some people never learn to park. That's simple human sense. Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. All right, Pirate fans, we're now in the fourth quarter. 12 minutes on the clock. Pirates have been running the ball a lot here. That's why it's 17 to nothing, and we're in the fourth quarter now. That clock goes quick. There's a snap. Hand off to Williams around the left side. Running He's room. Coming at us. Down and Moore still on still his feet. Still on his feet. Come see they me. They grab him from behind. Pull him out of bounds. 
Jamarian was coming to bring my uh, parts back for me, I believe, in that old pickup truck. Yep, he was coming right <laughs> to you, wasn't he? <laughs> Great run by the truck. Gain of about uh, 25 yards there. <laughs> Good blocking out there on the outside, too, and by your offensive line. He is tough to bring down. Jeremiah Riles over there, number 56, number 60, Jalen Smith. Number 61, Rhett Stone. Number 58, Mr. Leggett, Jared Leggett. And number 53, Michael Reed doing an awesome Snap. job of blocking. Oh, and, and a man gets Somebody through, but he, he may have got back to the line of scrimmage. What do you think? I think just Short at the uh, line of scrimmage. He, he, yeah. um, he went through a tackler coming at him. Yeah, one guy blew through and had a hand on him and spin him around. Jamarian's going to take a break. That's going to bring in Iron Man number four, Ed Williams. I haven't had his, seen a chance for him to break free, but I know this young man can run. Oh, yeah. Defensively, he's as stout as they get for the Pirates. Multi-player uh, for the Pirates. Plays both offense and defense. Good to have a utility player like that. Snap. Hands off to Williams. Oh, here he goes. He's got side. room. Oh, and he skips over one, but just barely tackled <laughs> around the left yeah, side yeah, there. First down. First down Pirates. I don't know Watch his run, David. Watch that move at the end of it that he made. Look at his hurdle. Track yep. man there. I know Sheldon Pierce would have loved to have that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, Pirates got it first and uh, yeah, is... 10. From around the 13. Snap. Another handoff. Edwards Williams. coming over here. And it's a touchdown, Pirates. He is the man, Iron Man. <laughs> Scores for the Pirates. Boom. David, I'm sorry. I forgot the boom. <laughs> <laughs> Ed Williams done that same little move he made down there a while ago. Man, I'll tell you that I young man is that athletic. Was. Karate Kid? What was that? That was the Karate Kid. That was way after your time. They, they didn't have TV back then, did they? Oh, no. Allen All right. Ramirez 23 to, to nothing. try for the extra point. Griffiths to hold. Snap to hold. The kick is up, and it's All right good. down the middle, David. That makes it 24 nothing. Your Pirates lead here in the fourth quarter. Folks, we're going to take a Pirate timeout, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. All right, welcome back, Pirate fans. It is 10 minutes left on the clock. Your Pirates just got a score, 24 to nothing here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. Alex Ramirez with a tumbling, fumbling kick, and uh, looks like it's going to be fielded by number six. He's screaming out of here. He got a hole, David. Yep. And the Pirates get him, and they do. That was number six for the Pirates, tackling number six, Jakari Kinsey, the king over there. That was a good return by that young that man. Very good return. Looking from the back side of that play, David, he found a hole there in the middle. Trayvon Rogers again. Yes, sir. That man, you can call him all night long for Tattnall County. I really didn't know who the young men were that got baptized, uh, David, but I want to tell six Myron Addison on the field. Tell them young men I'm proud of them, and, uh, you know, that's, that means more than anything. In life, That's so right. that was that was good stuff. It really yes, sir. Was. Be praying for them and their growth. And uh, here we go. Ain't every Tap. place you can get stuff like that happen. Tatnall no, County. sir. Kudos to y'all. Yes, sir. And these coaches. All right, it's first and ten for Tattnall County on the what the twenty-five yard line, David. Looks like it about the twenty. Maybe twenty-six. Looks like he's lining up over. He didn't get in that funky bunch again, but they hand off over here to number five, and number five tackles him. 
The that judge. is the judge. He said no more. The fine has been given, and the judgment has been judged. Darion Smith, the judge. That is a fine young man there. One of the <laughs> smoothest talking, <laughs> nice guys you'll ever meet in your life. I got to answer LZ Hayes and Jr. Smart. He asked a question, and I'm going to say, in a creek bed on the side road would be the best place for David. <laughs> muddy, <laughs> muddy water. Where would I get baptized? <laughs> Our defense is standing strong here. Another handoff over here to the right side. And guess who grabbed him but didn't hold on? Number 55. He got away from a, a but good he tackle. Him down enough where the rest of the guys can get in there and join the party. Yes, sir. Somebody threw a favor. and uh, Sean Moore, I think, coming there and got him. Watch this play right here, David, by your defense. Demario was in there. He just. Then it got off his block. Then Trayshawn. Man, uh, hit him and host of more. Pirates here on top of yep. him. What a good job by your Pirates. Going to make it uh, third and 12 for Tattnall. Number seven's having to come all the way across the field with the play. They didn't get in that uh, funky bunch they got in the uh, third quarter on us again. I've been, waiting to friendly. See, been waiting to see that again there, David. I like that. that was a I did too. Something different. Yep. Man oh, motion. quarterback keeps. Quarterback pulls it, trying to get oh, around. Oh, and does he, he get him? Number 16, Jamarcus Robinson, the hitter, with a tackle. And David wakes up again. He stayed home. He did. He done he a great job. He stayed home done a good job. Good game by number seven, the quarterback, Xavier Friendly. He's called his name a lot here tonight for Tattano County. But you're right, David. That number 52, I think uh, his name is Leviticus Butler as a senior. He's a tall young man out I'd there. I'd like to find out who number 70 is, but we don't have him on our sheet. No, we don't, David. I was trying I to name some of these kids when I see their numbers. Uh, got a number 17 in there that we don't have a 17. All right, they're in a punting situation. It's fourth and nine for Tattnall. And Kellen Eccles is back deep for the Pirates. David's still over here trying to wake up from a nap. Kicks straight down the oh, middle. High Kellen. punt. Gillen calls fair catch and gets it around the 43, 42 yard line. Pirates will take over and they're going to be coming our way, folks. 7.05 uh, on the clock. Call out some numbers here. Number one, Tristan Williams for Tatton. Okay. Well, I tell you what, that offense is getting ready to be on that field. They're not giving Cole no time to take a break here. No. Cole's, <laughs> Cole's just. He's hanging you out. You know what? Here. I think Cole's going to travel to Columbus in the morning. You think so? Yeah, I know he is. Uh, so. I've got to get him home early tonight where he can get some rest, where he can get up early in the morning. He's got to sure, he get there and make sure Jack ain't tearing something up. Yep. <laughs> All right, Pirates has got it here. We got uh, Jamari Williams and Jim. Who's that, Cameron George over here playing H-back? Yep. Looks There's like we're going to throw. Let us throw, but it picked up. Oh, what a job by your number 25, Kamoni Riles, the Kraken. He the reached down was, low. Yeah, the ball was thrown low, kind of behind him. That's an old pirate term for an old uh, big old, uh, was it an octopus? Is that what they are? Yeah, the Kraken. The Kraken, yeah. They swallow up ships in the sea. Yep. That boy's about swallows up anything that's thrown at him, I can tell you. Yeah. One maybe, miss that I've maybe seen Maybe that's tonight. what we are to call you. Cause <laughs> that's the way I eat, ain't it? <laughs> that's what you are to buffet. <laughs> you know, I don't do buffets. Cool. That's Tattle calls timeout, folks. 631 on the clock. Pirates lead 24 to nothing here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. We're going to take a break with them. Be right back with some pirate action. Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. All right, welcome back, Pirates. Give a big shout out to Chris McGuire all the way from upstate New York for watching us. Appreciate you joining our broadcast tonight. Hope we do a great job. All right, Pirates has got the ball first and 10 from around the 45-yard yep. line. Pirate band cheering them on up there in the stands, doing a great job. And 
All Taysom right. Williams in the backfield. Kind of a bad snap. He oh, he's coming to see me. He's coming to see me. Come on. He's coming. He's coming to see me. That's my man, the truck touchdown, <laughs> Pirates. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> That'll make it 30 to nothing for your Pirates. Look at this play right here. Man, what look a at the job. He, look at there. He just made a move on him right there, run straight to the end zone. All speed from there. What a job by the truck for the Pirates. Breaks it 30 to nothing here on your Village Pizza scoreboard. Extra points getting ready by none other than Alan Razor Ramirez. Snap, the hold, the kick is up. Actually perfect. That makes it 31 nothing. Your Pirates lead here in the fourth quarter. Folks, we're going to take a break, and we'll be right back with some Pirate action. ensures your small business because it isn't small to you that's simple human sense ask james m swain and associates in baxley and hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you. all right welcome back pirate fans your pirates just scored on a great run by jamar in the truck williams makes it 31 to nothing here in the fourth quarter on your village pizza scoreboard al ramirez with a deep kick back here into the end zone touchback touchback what a job by alan ramirez tristan williams was back deep and it just hits over his head what a job Maverick Baxley over here to retrieve the ball and throw it back in. He did, didn't he? Yeah. Great job. Good job, Maverick. Future Pirates. Yep. Got some of them over here. I'll tell you what, there was a group of young men over here, and I think your son was involved when yeah, Jamari well, made that touchdown. He come by and slapped these kids' hands and made their night, man, sure I'm telling did. you. That is good. Which they were excited for him too, David. That's what it's all about, brother. You hear yep. me? It is. They look up to these boys. Pirates and the future Pirates. They want they want the respect and, and – uh, these kids want to let them know that they are, they're going to follow in their footsteps coming up soon. That's right. These are middle schoolers that's looking forward to being in that area. Yes, sir. Tattnall County takes over here on the 20-yard line. Jeffrey Taylor standing on my back. <laughs> There's a snap. Hand off to the running back. He breaks around the left-hand side. But you know what he said he's going to do? Got him. Jeffrey said he's going to arrest me for being the number one broadcaster. <laughs> <laughs> He ought to arrest you for ugling up the public. <laughs> well, no, that's what he was going to do to you. Oh, no. <laughs> and I, I, I stood in your way, David. Oh, is that what it yeah, was? Yeah, I told Jeff he couldn't do that. Second you were hey, driving. He was going to arrest you, but you couldn't fit in the back seat of his car. <laughs> no, the cuffs wouldn't fit my big old <laughs> arms. <laughs> All right, folks, it's second and ten for Tattnall, 31 to nothing here on Juventus Pizza scoreboard. I'll tell you what, there's been a pile of running tonight. That's why we're uh, where we're at at this moment. Well, we came out throwing the ball. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the first, the first drive was a lot of throws. A lot of Nehemiah Howard. Yes, sir. Up, and then we come back, Jamarion Williams. I'll tell you what, that number 33 is a good-looking kid over there, yeah, David. Uh, they tried to run to the right side, trying to run off the tackle, and we stacked and him up. And I mean, up. a host of Pirates in there on top of that play, David. Ball got back to the line of scrimmage. May have got a little more. I'll tell you what, there's a lot of great athletes over here in uh, Tattnall County, and we we played a lot against a lot of them. They've beat us before. We beat them. Uh, matter of fact, I remember a game where we were here and uh, – to win the game, to be in the playoffs, and yeah. uh, they give us everything we wanted. Well, Tattnall's one beat of them. Us. Tattnall's one of them places. You come over here, and you you like coming over here to play them, but you dread playing them. <laughs> you do because you never know what you're getting. You don't. I mean, they're they're tough. They're a tough team. Tough tough young men. All right, a snap. Kind of a low snap. Quarterback keeps it, runs around the edge. We almost had him in the backfield. It just there. slips out of Ed's reach over there. And number five, the judge, Nehemiah Howard, wrapped him up. I believe he's short of the first down, though, David. That makes it fourth and short, they call it. Uh, maybe fourth and, uh, what, three yards maybe, fourth and third? Yeah, it's short. 
They got a fourth and five on their clock, and they can see better than I can. So, and our awesome guy down here doing the the clock tonight, <laughs> keeping me straight. Looks like they're in a punting situation. Now, this young man punting tonight has kept the ball away from our our man Kellen Eccles doing a fine job. Yep. I want to thank uh, Tattnall County and their administration for allowing us to be here tonight. Yes. We enjoy we it. We are a class act. Yes, sir. Nice Low, kick. Fair catch call. Kellen catching it down on his knees. All right. Pirates take over around the 45-yard line. Good field position. Around the 45. Roland Jackson, uh, I want to tell you appreciate that. Uh yeah, that means a lot to David and I. Um, appreciate you know what you're doing, and we are. We work hard to try and bring the best and do the best for these young men on these fields, and uh, that means a lot coming from you, my friend. I, I really yes. do appreciate that. There's Looks like point. we got some new pirates. Number 21's got the ball. Darion Hood All just right. tackled. Gain of about five. Game. Yes, sir. Got, hey, looks like we got the second strings in here, David. You know what these young men did last week? They went over to Vidalia. Look JV at number did. 84. We don't know that kid. Uh, but they went over to Vidalia and give Vidalia everything they wanted, 42 to 6. Look at here. We got some running room. That's number 20. That is Nate Davis. You can look forward to calling his name soon. Future with Pirates. This That's young right. man has got some wheels. Another man out. Looks like it's a first down for the Pirates. Got Shane the Warrior Gillis out wide. Another handoff over here. Gain of what, about four or five yards yeah. there, David? Every time we've seen the younger guys get in there, they run hard. They've done a great job, and they don't slack up. They won't give up. They're a gritty bunch. They are. The, and you can tell it too, David. Look at that run. The right for the Pirates. Oh, I always say that. We've got a lot of kids, and they know what it means to be a Pirate on that field. All right, we got some running room here. Who's that running the ball? That's number seven, Adrian Venom Williams. Wow. You know, I don't I don't try to compare many players, but I can tell you what Adrian's build on him, man. That young man looks good. His brother was a great pirate, athlete for the Pirates. And he's doing the same. Pirates looks like up again. Javez Johnson back there in the backfield. Oh, he's got Javez, some running rooms. The Jet Johnson. Wow. Talked to him the other night. He said, I want a nickname. It's Javez to Jet Johnson. All right, there you have it. One more stride, and he could have been in the end zone. I want to see him score a touchdown here. This is the last play. He's got it. Running room. Can he make it? Oh, is he there? Just short. Just shy. I believe that's going to be the ball game, folks. Your Pirates come away with a 31-0 victory here in the fourth quarter. Another region win. Uh, folks, what a ball game. Got an interesting score right now. Cook is up seven to nothing in the third quarter. Uh, any other scores there, Over David? Fitzgerald. Over Fitzgerald right now. I know that's got to be a barn burner of a Pierce game. Pierce is 21-7 over Vidalia. In the third quarter. Right, third quarter. Guys, this will, means a lot for us. Uh, Cole, I know we need to take a quick break. We're going to come back and give everybody the play a game, and we're going to assess it, and we're going to call it a night. Cole's got to get up early in the morning, so we're not going to stick around late tonight for you folks. But we will be back next week for senior night at Appling County, our last home game, regular home game of the season. Uh, we, we hope to uh, show up, show, show up, show up, show out, and show these seniors exactly how much they that you care about them. That's right. We're going to take a quick break, give us time to get our play of the game, and we'll be right back with some pirate action. your car because some people never learn to park that's simple human sense 
Ask Rents and Rents Insurance in Baxley if auto owners make sense for you. Are you feeling tired or sluggish? Experiencing joint pain, changes in your hair or your skin? Have I got a solution for you? At the IV Drip Parlor, we can offer you the most effective way to get vitamins directly into your bloodstream, making you feel better and look better fast. We can't wait to schedule your appointment today or to see you just walk in. We are dripping with excitement to help you meet your best self. Come meet us at the IV Drip Parlor. Football is all about teamwork. Every player does his job. Every player is on the same page. And the team never quits. Never. Never. We follow the same playbook at Woody Folsom Auto Group in Baxley and are proud to support the Appling County Pirates. Better get the back and let's do it. Do it. Healthy Community Centers are proud to bring you Nicole Lee and Cheryl Cox, family nurse practitioners, providing primary care, DOT physicals, MAT therapy, chronic care management, and more. Give us a call at 912-705-2273 and let us help you stay healthy. your small business because it isn't small to you that's simple human sense ask james m swain and associates in baxley and hazelhurst if auto owners make sense for you all right welcome back pirate fans uh getting up close and personal there uh david david's got a bigger head than i do uh folks we just come off a great region win we won 31 to nothing here tonight over tattnall county a great great team here uh, great community over here. We love our South Georgia family. We, do. Uh, we right would consider the river from us. Yes, great sir. Coach. They are family to us, and we consider them family, and we appreciate that. Uh, appreciate them allowing us to be here tonight and enjoying this, you know, victory. Uh, but David, what a game! What a uh, game! It's a great you know, I kind of said it earlier. We come up out a little flat. I know we've got some injuries and and things going on that some are still trying to heal and and do some things like that. And our Pirates are coming off the field now after being spoken to by their coaches. Uh, proud of these young men but we have a play of the game and we like to do this every game we get to broadcast and uh, we all pick it there's me and david and, and cole and cole has it uh it's fixing to bring it to us cole you ready for the play of the game are you ready for the play of the game folks at home here it goes this is right here. Jamarion wins takes the handoff makes one or two miss gets around another and runs straight to the end zone Y'all didn't get to Nobody see it, but I was you. waving him home. He I said, come home, home, come see me. And uh, Jamarian was looking at me, and he was coming right at me. Our kids are coming off the field, proud of these young men, uh, proud of what they do. Got Alan Ramirez, Wesley Hendricks coming by us. Yep. Uh, Darion is coming by us. One of my favorite nice. kids across the way. More of our boogie man. Coming in behind <laughs> us over here. Yes, sir. You'll see them meeting some of their family and talking to them Thanks. and congratulating them. Uh, but, guys, we want to say this. We want to congratulate our Lady Pirates. You still got work to do. Get your rest tonight. You got a ball game tomorrow. Thank you, ladies, for watching us tonight and supporting your Pirates. We appreciate that. <clears throat> we got Gooch over here across us. 
uh, you yep. know, behind us. He'll come in behind. He'll come in behind us. He he won't know it until he gets home to watch us. And that's Goo this Trier. Is, this is our player of the game right here to play the game right play here. Play the game. Jamari on the truck, William. <laughs> did, did I did I wave you down fast enough? Did I give you a little extra energy to get here? <laughs> hey, proud of you, man. Go Good Pirates, job, buddy. buddy. Proud of you. Look Go get this. you some rest. Here's another one right here. <laughs> we will later on. Got the boogeyman back there. <laughs> one of my favorite, Jacquez Van. Uh, we don't get to do this very often, nah, David. I love we, it, man. We love it. Players family. coming right here. Hey, we, we, we're hometown guys. We love our kids. Here's another one right Good kid right here. That, that's Same my boy right here. Gillis. Gilly, Gilly Wagon. Uh, lo- love that kid. But, hey, we want to thank uh, everybody at home that watches. Those that are not home but are Pirate fans out of state, you know, out of town. Appreciate you guys. But I wanted to say this before we got interrupted there. Lady Pirates, we're looking at you. You have fun. Enjoy your game. We got this. Bring it home to Bring Baxley, home. Georgia. We love you. Proud of you. Regardless of what happens tomorrow, always going to love you. Uh, but bring it home, okay? And, Cole, I like to say this. Chris Floyd is a pirate for life. David. David Heron's a pirate for life. And beam me up, Cole. Let's go. <laughs> go pirate.